Investigators are still here trying to get to the bottom of exactly what unfolded here in the 1300 block of Larchmark. I can tell you this. Uh, investigators say that they don't know exactly what happened, but they do know the men got into a horrible fight. One man was shot and killed. The other was stabbed. I was actually quite shocked to um, look outside getting ready to <laughs> walk and see seven cop cars outside my door. What happened? A fight between two men. The actual altercation, from my understanding, took place outside the residence. Though the fight happened in the backyard, witnesses say other people, including small children, were at the house during the deadly fight. I guess there was a robbery attempt that started the whole thing, and the whole event happened in front of children. So, And then the girl was brought over here. And uh, the girl was maybe like seven years old with blonde hair. WLKY News arrived minutes after the shooting and ran into the father of the man injured in the fight. He also told us someone tried to rob his son. And now the man is dead in the backyard. But police say at this time they don't know what the men were fighting about. Apparently, there was some type of altercation between what appears to be two men at this point. Uh, specifically, what that altercation consisted of, we're still trying to determine. Uh, I can tell you that that altercation resulted in one man being. Shot. Uh, he was actually pronounced deceased here on the scene behind a residence. We had another man who apparently sustained at least one stab wound. Police say the man killed is in his 40s. Preliminarily, it appears as if this is a contained situation. In other words, it doesn't seem as if we have any uh, outstanding suspects. At this time, the man who was stabbed was taken to University Hospital to be treated for a non life threatening injury. At this time, no one has been arrested and the investigation is continuing. That is the very latest this hour. Kimberly Easton, WLKY News.